Uh, back at North Kilworth Wharf, 8 o'clock Saturday morning, had an early start. So yeah, here nice and early, get on with the roof again this weekend, uh, see who's about. Cool, let's get to it. So it's about half nine Saturday morning, let's just have a look at the paint I did last week. It doesn't appear to be in too bad condition, so now it's perfect, looks like it was painted last week. Couple of bits to pay attention to, but I just wanted to check out the seam. This seems pretty good. With all of that, I mean, obviously, everything will need a sanding. Cleaning up, still a wet bit wet down this end where it's still in the shade. But uh, we'll see if we can get on and do a bit more this weekend. I mean, at least the end of the boat, and that may be this whole chunk up to the paint line, uh, the front of the boat, maybe this section because uh, you know it's dry quicker. We can get on it sooner. I don't know yet, we'll see how we get on. Just wait to check how this looks. It's all taken fine, there's no real clouding. It feels nice and hard. Yeah, obviously there's some bits of pitting that have shined through. Uh, I'll dab them with some more paint when I'm painting later and then we'll sand them off uh, when it's time to do the next coat. But yeah, cool, a weekend of work ahead of us. So just up on the roof now, uh, doing some mopping. Just taking off any extra excess moisture that's still up here. Uh, looking at doing all of this bit. I think this weekend it's uh, pretty well done now but yeah just wait for the sun to break the trees and then we'll get started doing this end cool Well, for the time lapse, uh, didn't capture any of the, the actual scrabbling, so that kind of sucks. Hopefully, the low one did. Uh, in about an hour and a half, it's about 20 to 4, so in about an hour and a half, I've done this much of the roof with the scrabbler. Used about four scrabbler pads, down to about halfway through this one. So, yeah, not too bad. Just going to clean it all up with a vacuum and take a 10 minute break, get a little bit of food, get a drink. And then I might see about finishing off to the edge of the boat today. So then hopefully we'll get some rust treatment on about five, half five. Get some paint on it about six, half six. And it's got two hours before the sun goes down just to cure off a little bit before it starts to get a little bit dark and cool.
just got all this ready to <clears throat> paint it now. Uh, one phone's got no memory left, one phone's got no battery left, so we'll see how we get on with the painting. But yeah, just about to uh, progress on with that now. About 5, 20 past 5 in the evening. Got all this back to bare metal and done all the rust treatment. So now we're ready for paint. Fantastic. That's now the port side of the boat roof finished with paint. Of course, I made up way too much paint, so I went around and gave this all a second coat as well, so the paint ran out. Uh, got to about there, got to about there, I think. So, yeah, did uh, a little bit of a dab in with some paint on all of these little divots. And, you know, they'll get sanded and painted and sanded and painted. But, yeah, that's half the boat painted now, or half the boat roof painted. Quite an extensive day, uh, quite tired, uh, muscles hurt, arms hurt. I'm covered in dirt, like all like under the, all the way up to like the armpit. I don't even know what the, what my face is like. I haven't had a look yet in the mirror. Uh, so yeah, it's been, uh, been a pretty eventful day. Uh, yeah, so, like I say, half the boat roof painted now. Magic hour now, sun's just going down. Yeah, it looks amazing. There's already bits of plants and leaves and bugs in it. Well, not so much bugs. It's a little late in the year uh, for the bugs. But yeah, it's half the boat painted, guys. Can't believe it. Just this is a before and after. It's not been too bad. Half the boat painted. So we'll see what we can do on Sunday. <laughs> and also, I've kind of gone over the middle, so there's more than half the boat painted, like 55%, maybe 60. Well, 8 o'clock Sunday morning, just thought I'd come check out the paint. It's all covered in dew. But it's all looking good. So it's about half 11 now, I've got all my gear prepped. I'm about to get started to grind uh, this part of the roof off. I'm going to see how far we get down, hopefully, all being well, if I've got enough energy, we'll get down to at least the second mushroom vent. Uh, but we'll see how we get on. Cool. So it's about half past two now, quarter three, something like that. Uh, just finished grinding for the day. I could probably do a little bit more, but I feel pretty much spent. And as much as I grind, I've got to paint it yet. So I've only got halfway between the second and third mushroom vents uh, after doing the, uh, the rest of the end yesterday. But I've pretty much got this all the way back to bare metal. There's some quite extensive pit in here. I was thinking about doing, using some of the marine filler, but I'll just fill it with a rush treatment and paint over it. Um, but yeah, so we'll get on with this. We'll just get it tidy up. I mean, it's a bit of a mess up here now. 
but let's have a look at this paint a little bit later on. So like I say, it's been on, I don't know, 20 hours now, something like that. Feels pretty good, feels pretty hard. So yeah, I'm sure it'll get there. Bit of, a bit of cleaning up to do. But yeah, so uh, on to more painting, more treatment and painting. So, I mean, I did want to get up to this crack today and it doesn't look like a lot, but you know, there's maybe an hour, an hour's grinding there. So yeah, I'm gonna knock it on the head for today and then we'll get on with some painting real quick. Uh, let's give this a tidy up first, yeah? So up on the roof, it's about half past three. I've done this section here. Uh, taking it all back to bare metal, taking all the mill scale off. And getting ready to paint now. Like I said before, not quite as much done as I'd like to have done today, but you know, I was kind of burning out a little bit. So, but that's all that bit done. There's still a little bit more of the boat left to do. Another maybe two sessions, maybe three sessions, depending how lazy I'm feeling. But yeah, getting there, get there, absolutely getting there. So yeah, let's get this painted. So just up on the roof now, uh, just finished painting, got that section done, yeah it's definitely on the way, but that's the thing with painting anything white, sooner or later it's going to get dirty. Uh, we put a little bit of an extra coat on this end where I thought it was a bit thin last night, so I've just uh, put an extra coat on that bit there, and to be fair all of this has had a second coat when I've uh, done extra paint I'm going over it. That's another good chunk of the boat painted. Maybe two more sessions and we should have the whole thing finished. It's bank holiday weekend next weekend, so we get an extra day, so we'll see how we get on. Uh, I'll definitely get you know, up to this center line next weekend, uh, weather permitting. Didn't quite get as far as I wanted to, but you know, is what it is. It's a lot of the boat done. Uh, yeah, it's pretty good. It's been a good weekend, kind of tiring. All that's left now is to tidy up. Uh, clean everything up and get home so yeah awesome well just half a day scrabbling has left me looking like a chimney sweep so i mean i'm uh, filthy through and through so yeah absolutely so yeah we get washed up now and yeah get cleaned up go home well it's about five o'clock now just got the rest of the boat to clean down and then i'm going to go but this looks amazing uh really feels like we made progress I'll have a quick look from up on top of the roof in a minute, but uh, yeah, this is looking fantastic. I can't believe how much we got done in just a couple of weeks. Yeah, I have to start thinking of a colour for the top coat of the roof. Let me know what you think, what colour it should be. You should do it pink, light blue, cream, uh, bright white, paint it all black like the rest of it. Let me know what you think. Well, that's a clean boat and a clean me. Time to get out of here for another week. Uh, 
I've got to kill all the main power now and take the drive home, back to Lincoln, back to work. So yeah, that'll do it for me for another weekend at North Kilworth Wharf. Uh, it's been quite a weekend, got quite a bit of the boat painted, that's definitely over half of the roof done now. Yeah, maybe one, maybe two more sessions. Like I said, bank holiday next weekend, so maybe we'll get this done. Uh, next session, want to come up to at least uh, the centre line. Doesn't look like much, but that's probably three hours. Um, so, we'll see how we get on. But yeah, I mean, the next layers after this are relatively easy. You just take a sander, like 230 grit to 320 grit, and just uh, go over it all smooth and put additional coats on it. So the rust that takes the real time. Uh, that and getting a good finish, you know, that's a, that's an art in itself. But yeah, thanks a lot for watching everybody. Hope you're all having a good time out there. Yeah, another fun weekend. See you next time.